Hey guys, it's your girl 007 Georgia Peach. I know it's been a while, but I am back. Um, I'm coming to you with a Dollar Tree haul. And I also got some hidden gems I also want to share um, with you guys um, from Walmart. It's a very short one, but it is a well worth staying tuned to see what I have. So let's get started. I found the Therapeutic Hand Cream um, by this brand. I don't know how to pronounce it, so I'll just let you see it. <laughs> Um, I let my hubby use it. He loves it. Um, I have not used it just yet. They also have um, the baby diaper rash. Um, if you're looking for something like that. I don't have any babies anymore. They're big. So I also found, found sorry, the Shimmering Vanilla Wishes. Um, this one is in vanilla brown sugar. And also the Mango Passion. I have used this and I love it. Um, how I go by using it is I would spray my whole body um, before putting on my clothing. Because um, where, like, say for instance, perfect example, this blouse here, as you can see, um, I would spray here and here wherever the sun will reflect because it has little shimmers in it and it's perfect for summer. Um, perfect for those um, days on the beach. You get my drift. Um, and the smell is nice. It's really nice. Um, it doesn't stay around long, which I like. Um, if it did, that'll be a bonus, but it doesn't. So I would recommend you, you know, put it where you want, you know, the, the shimmers to show. Then you can put, um, on whatever fragrance you want on top of it because it's, it's not going to last that long, but it's, um, a nice smell nonetheless. I also found, um... Okay, the Bolero Pure Bath Soap. I love these. Um, this is the, the Lavender Champagne. I also bought the Mango, what was it? Mango something in the same brand. Um, the bar is very big. Um, it lathers very nicely. But as far as the fragrance, I have to be honest, it doesn't last long. So if you're not into a lot of perfumey uh, bath soap, you will enjoy this. You would definitely enjoy something like this. And it's 100% vegetable-based formula enriched with nourishing essential oils, suitable for all skin types to leave a soft and clean feel. And it's also a six ounce bar. And it's made in the USA. Um, I don't know if you ladies found these, but these work wonders. Um, it's by Fabrice. This one is the Moonlight Lavender. This one's really nice. And they only have one of these, but I have used these all around my home. And trust me, these are great. Um, it has a nice throw in small spaces, but I can say for big spaces because I have pretty big rooms, they do very well. I have boys, so yeah, they do really nice. Um, I use these in um, closets bathrooms, hallways, it's really nice. This one I have yet to use, but they have the little scratch um, thing here um, to smell this fragrance. Um, this is Greek Seaside here, and this one smells really nice. I wish they had more of these, but they have this one, the Sleepy, I'm sorry, Sleepy, Sleep Serenity by Febreze um, with lavender, and that's really nice. So I stocked up on these. It's only one dollar tree and it's far out. But when I do go over there, I just I grab the whole thing and just go for it. Because on the stores, I know I'm gonna pay a lot. Um, they also have the same brand in Antissum Stretch Mark Cream. Uh, minimizes the appearance of stretch marks. Um, this one here is a five ounce. And the texture. On this is really nice. It's like a, a thick lotion, but it's nice. It doesn't have a medicated smell or anything. It's really nice. So my Dollar Tree was carrying these at the time. I'm just now holding this, so I wanted to share. Also, the Broadway Fashion Nails. I always have a tendency to do my own, but sometimes on special occasions, I might just put on some falsies. But when in doubt, I grab the ones I get from the Dollar Tree. Um, I have not used this brand yet, so I can't really give you um, 
to say yay or nay, but I've heard some of the ladies on YouTube say that they're really good, really nice. Um, I'm not sure about the glue. I think they get other glue that um, the Dollar Tree provides. Now, this was a bookmark, but it fell out of the package. The package will look something like this, and it looks like this, um, like a peacock. They, um, I saw um, they had butterfly and a flower, but um, this one was the best to me. So I'm doing a lot of reading since my boys are out of school. They are also doing reading. Um, when they're out of school, the school provides, well, suggests that they do a lot of reading. So, so I get some reading in since they're out. Also, my wet and wild brushes. I could not wait to find these. These girls here. Yes. Okay. And my favorite color is pink and purple. And they have these in pink. Oh, can you imagine they had them in purple? Oh. Anyway, this is the contour brush by Wet n Wild. And the brushes um, are very soft. I've already got my feel. Uh, this one is a small eyeshadow brush. Um, it's been really warm, hot lately, so a lot of times I don't, on special occasions, I will play in my makeup, <laughs> crease brush, like going to church, weddings, something like that, but just to sit out in the sun and melt, mm, no thank you. And they're really nice too. I'm not sure, oh, this is another um, crease brush as well. And I need it like two because you can never go wrong with a crease brush, especially when you're playing with different colors. And that's what I like to do. Also, I'm wearing um, this. I wanted to try out this new creamy caramel. I have been using it. I put it on very lightly, but I do like it. Um, I got it from Dollar Tree. It's the uh, NYC Expert Last Lip Color. And this one is... Creamy caramel. Really nice new. Um, I don't know, the number is 440. I don't know if you can see it on there, what my camera will allow you. Um, they had other colors um, there today when I went and I didn't grab them. I said next time. And usually I regret when I say next time because I know better when you see it. You get it then, you don't wait. And they had all cut. They had wine. They had something called Brizzo or Bryce. It was also like a brown. It, it looks like this color, but maybe just a tad bit darker. Maybe it looks like it would give off the same thing, but just a little um, maybe a light undertone of shimmer. Really nice. This also by F Studio Lip Pencil. I, sh I should have tried this one, used this one to see how it would react to this color. But I got this one, and this one is in clear. I also got eye primer and liner sealer, and they're clear and natural. I guess on the, I see this tip here, and I guess that's for clear. I guess for your I'm assuming for your eyeliner, when you put the eyeliner, and I know for sure the eye primer, of course, goes under there. I know that. So I definitely got two because I can definitely use two of those. And that's it for my Dollar Tree. Now, I've been waiting to show you guys this, but I'm going to ask for forgiveness now because I have been burning my candles. See, I already told you before I even showed you. See? Anyways, I've been burning my candles for um, some time, and all of the, the scents that I should have shown you and shared with you. I haven't because I've been, been you know, kind of lazy. But I'm going to share the ones that I have left. Um, now, these are from Walmart. Um, um, this is a 18 ounce by Better Homes. Better Homes. They have to be Better Homes. Um, Pink Sugar Berry, um, limited edition, made in USA. Blase, blase. Anyway, they're scanning. They're scanning a Walmart for $1.50, which is perfect. Other states, um, some ladies have said a dollar, but my state is $1.50. These will run you $5 and some change on clearance, supposedly on clearance. And when they're not on clearance, they're, you can see the prices, they're $14, $15. So um, I would suggest 
that the ones that you see for five dollars to put them in your basket this is what i usually do put them in my basket go to a scanner look at the barcode scan the barcode and see the prices they have some for three dollars but i'm waiting for those to go down to um a dollar fifty and those are probably the summer and spring scents you know now and I, I can wait because I have so many candles but this particular one um, is scanning for a dollar fifty and this is the pink uh, sugarberry and it smells delicious the throw oh my goodness it's beautiful also they have the white birch leaves and better homes um, as you can tell um, that this scent uh, the pink berry kind of remind me of a, like a summer scent so um, I don't know why they marked that particular one down for one fifty, but I'm not mad at all because the throw around my whole house, all I have to do is light one candle and it takes care of everything. I'm not complaining at all. I haven't tried the white birch. Um, one is a definitely a, um, a winter candle, but I have white candles. I don't care what season it is. This is really nice. And they're all 18 ounces. And this is great. Also, I am burning this one right now. This one is called by Better Homes uh, Frosted Honey Cake. It smells like dessert in a jar. For $1.50, I am not mad and complaining at all. So each of these candles, like I was getting like maybe five each because my whole basket was full of candles. So I said, well, I have to be the one to take these to the car. I have to make sure I can, you know. This one, Harvest Berry Pumpkin, OMG. Now usually I'm the one to stay away from pumpkin scents. Like, no, I don't. I am so glad I gave this a try. This, this was actually one of my favorites. Like I'm so surprised. Like it doesn't have that overpowering cinnamon or overpowering pumpkin. It's like the, the right amount of all of this is great. Like. I will definitely get to my Walmart and do exactly what I said. And if you do, please be so kind to, um, if you found the candles, please leave it in the comment section below and let me know the um, the kind that you got or were you lucky enough to score these. So I will definitely get, get what I showed you if you see them. And even more, like if you see them for five something or even three something, just put it in your cart and scan it and see um, what uh, will pop up on the scanner because a lot of times they don't mark the candles and even the ones for three might be less than three. The ones for 150 might be less than, they just don't go back and, um, you know, scan it. So please, you know, leave in the comment section below if you've scored like I have, okay? You guys have a blessed day and I'll see you again, bye.